We're back in Forza Horizon 4 and it is summer and night. Um, terrible time to record, I guess. But it is summer. Um, the month has swapped over. We got another month of playlist. This time we got some new cars. Um, so yeah. We are actually going to be checking out a very, very new car to Forza. The ID Zero Uno or Zero Uno. Zero Uno, Zero Uno, how do you pronounce that? Some people are calling it Zero Uno, so that's fine. So, to do this, it's a circuit, a uh, road racing series, probably mostly circuits, using S2998 hypercars. Um, you're supposed, you, to win this car, you have to come first against highly... Expert? No, highly skilled drivers or something like that. Expert or some some stuff. So we are gonna do that, and because I am a lunatic, I'm gonna be playing those um, road racing races in unbeatable, just to give myself a challenge. In 100 meters, so yeah, so we're gonna do some lead. unlocking and customization, just to see how this car is. Apparently, it's supposed to be like a. Um, Audi R8 and a Lamborghini Huracan, which is pretty cool. So yeah, I'll drive there. I'll probably skip this in the video, so you don't have to worry about it being long and boring like my other ones. Okay, we have made it to the championship. Uh, let's see. So yeah, it is highly skilled drivers. You have to come first against um, eligible cars. Yep, it's literally all the hyper cars, including the Lego Senna. <laughs> I have a bunch of them. Wow, I have so many hypercars. Probably by the time Horizon 5 comes you know out, we'll have like. Well, I'll have all the, the hypercars and uh, pretty much all the cars actually. Much, really. have fun. She did not sound very enthusiastic there. Okay, let's go to class. What are we gonna take? We got the Chiron, we got the Regera, we got the Senna, we got the Lego Senna. Um, apparently, the Lego Senna is faster than the normal Senna. Uh, okay, so we have to definitely drive something that's 998 because they're better. I know the Rimac is heavy but fast. Um, you know what? Let's take the center for the memes. There's no music. This loading screen's awkward because my character's dancing. <laughs> No, oh, why is the music when I turned it off? Put streamer mode on. Okay, let's go. Three races. This should be fun. Hopefully. Oh, we have another Lego Center in the race too. He might be a problem, maybe. Oh my god, I missed that like an idiot. <laughs> I haven't played Forza in a week, so I might be a bit rusty. I've been playing other games. A lot. So it's three laps, we need to get into first, hopefully. I'm gonna try not to embarrass myself other than that one time I had to rewind. Let's go. Lego Santa is not catching up to them. Okay, I caught up now. We've got a Veyron in first. That doesn't happen. The Veyron doesn't turn very well. And it's very heavy. And we are in first, in second lap. Now we have to keep this, and then win. And there'll be two more races, easy peasy. Okay, I'm used to the physics already. There we go. Now to kick ass.
Ooh, I took that turn wide. Ooh. That wasn't good. Really, in really far in first. No way they're gonna catch up to me unless I like spin out and something stupid happens, which might happen. Okay, let's take this corner like a per normal person. There we go. I could switch cars so we have like we're driving like different cars each race. That'd be cool. Yeah, I might do that actually. I kind of like driving this Lego Center. It's faster than the standard Center when you upgrade it to max S2 class. Look at that. The Center's podium. <laughs> Two Lego Centers were in podium. Okay, where the hell's the next one? Look for the white. Okay, we got this one. Does it go near the other one? Yes, it does. So we'll take this one. I like how the championships have like a nice path. So the next race is always leading to the next race. So you don't have to drive as far. Unless you're doing a circuit race. Then then you have to drive somewhere. So yeah, let's, let's do so, a bit of driving. Meters. Turn right. Turn right. You didn't see that. I did not break late. In okay, should we use the same car or take someone else? Let's see. We got a Regera, a Chiron, and a Senna. And these are my only hyper cars I have access to. And we got this car. Hmm. Let's go Chiron. See what happens. That. Chiron's pretty heavy as well for a car, but it looks really nice, especially with the paint I put on it. I made it look like the original paint, but I put a more reflective paint on it, so it's much shinier. I, I make this car look more expensive, because <laughs> the original paint jobs are no boring. Off the launch, we're already in ninth. Ooh! This one likes to slide a bit. Regera had a moment there. Hit the brakes. Back on the acceleration. Hit the brakes again and acceleration. You gotta be quick. Coming out off the fifth. Oh, drafting. has gone wide a bit. I do need to hit the brakes there. This thing slides a lot. I don't think this is a smart idea taking this car. Okay, well, let's get back to let's chase this down. The La Ferrari and the Aventador are having a ba bit of a battle for um, fourth place. But here's me passing the La Ferrari and taking fifth, ramming fourth. Let, let, let's get past fourth. The damage, I think, I damage is right rear head on um, rear light. Okay, we're in six. 60% in and I'm still not in first, so we're doing terribly. Okay, passing fourth right about now. Yep. Okay, sliding it like a idiot. Okay, there's another Aventador in front of me. Let's see if I can pass him. We've got a Veyron in first. Let's go. Bugatti's gonna win, no matter what, in this race. I hope it's my one, not the that guy's. Okay. Ooh, come on! I really needed to slam the brakes there, come on! That Bugatti hit the brakes for no reason! Oh! Drafting! Didn't shift! No, 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 no! No, 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 no! 
Why did you hit the brakes at the end of the race? I still came second anyway. But that was a close race. Look at that. A hundred. Is that a hundred or, or a tenth? I don't know, but that was pretty close. That's the first time I've actually commentated most of the race without really taking a breath. So I am impressed by my ability to commentate this time. I am happy. Okay, we're probably going to use the normal McLaren Senna on the last race because Senna's are really good in this game. Like, they have a lot of downforce. A lot. They did pretty well for sure on. I'm happy with that. Right there. In four hundred meters, turn right. Turn right. arrived at your destination okay let's let's do it let's take the good old center I'm not happy with the paint job I put on this car I think the blue was a little too extreme yeah something just doesn't look right when I look at this paint job on the car but back with the center let's see if we can come at least second and probably come first and overall in the championship Hopefully. As long as the Bugatti comes behind me, the Veyron, if that comes after me, then I win the championship. And why did I shift early on that? I am an 11th. Okay. Let's get around these guys. Oop. Accidentally hitting him. Wait, is that the new Zuno, Zero Uno right there? Huh. Okay. I don't know why I keep off-roading. Literal accident. Okay, let's get past 8 first. Okay. I didn't need to break there, but I did it anyway. I don't know why. Oh my god! The Pagani just passed me. That felt rubber banded. Oh no. Oh no! Not the Ferrari! Please no! Come on, catch up, catch up! On the outside. Let's go, I don't know why they hit the brakes. Okay, we're back in 8th again. And I've done 70% of, 80% of the race. And I'm still in 8th, so this was a terrible race. I'm probably gonna use the Lego Center because that's much lighter and quicker. This is an embarrassment to all of, all of me, yeah. If I embarrass myself, I'm gonna change cars. That was terrible. Restart event. Nuh-uh. We ain't having none of that. Okay, um, let's quit it and switch cars. The center is really slow. Okay, where is the race? There it is in front of me, and there is music playing, and I don't know why. Okay, there we go. Stop. We will take the Lego Senna, because that is faster and better in every way. Who knew a brick could be faster than an actual aerodynamic beast? Hmm. <laughs> Let's go! 
already in 10th place. Let's go for 9th. Yep, ninth side of moment. Now eighth, Parsony. Oh, I am crashing into the back of sixth. Okay. Now we're fighting for fourth. Gonna draft them a bit. Let's see if we get some drafting going on. And passing fourth, I kind of scratched him on the left right there. Well, it was a dirty pass. Not great. Um, the Aventador just had an issue right there. Okay, now we got an Aguero in front of us, and I cannot make out the details of the other car. But it better not be Veyron. Uh, the Aguero just crashed in the wall, and that is, uh... Hmm... What was the car called again? I really forgot the name of this car. It was using Fast and Furious 7. It was by W Motors. I don't remember the name! What is wrong with me? What is in first? Okay, I've taken that wide. Nope, that's still a restart. Zombie Machine has come first again. That means, oh, hyper, like in hypersword, that's what it is. Okay, I have to do that race again because Zombie Machine is the person who came first and second in the other races. And he was, he's, he was the guy in the Veyron, so, you know, gotta beat him. That's how I guarantee my win. Damn it, no! Okay, come on. Let's get to the hypersport. You need to go down, boy. Yep, in second now. Okay. Let's gain on first. First just suddenly took off. Oh my god. These cars have like a lot of top speed against me. It's kind of sucks. But he cannot come first. Okay, he slowed down. Let's hit the brakes so we have a bit more control over that corner. We're catching up to him. He's gonna hit the brakes again now. Yep, there we go. Let's gear down so we got more power. And shift back up again. Hit the brakes a bit. That's a smooth corner. There we go, go in the dirt a bit, and we're finishing first, and we're unlocking the Zeruno. Zeruno, Zeruno. There we go, hype tour. This video is going to be kind of long, in it? Probably going to add like a skip to customizations bit in the video. Ooh, look at that. Looks like a hurricane, but with like teeth. <laughs> Zero Uno, Hurricane with Teeth. That's what it'll be. So yeah. First thing I'm gonna do is um wow what well, is this is taking a while. First thing I'm gonna do is drive the Zero Uno stock, see how it performs against unbeatable drivers, and then I will proceed to customizing it. See what we got. Ah, oh, why did I rub my eyes? It's been bad over there for a while. Okay, where the hell do I go? Infinity, internet, uh, Ital Design, there we go. Zero Uno. Didn't GTA release like a car that looks very similar to this? Hmm. I think GTA's been watching what Forza's been doing, that's why they released their car around the same time. Look at this car, it's nice. So, this is using the same V10 engine as the Hurricane and the R8. So they'll have very similar performance. Okay, before we customize, we race it. Need to know how good it is, so. Best race to 
attack on is the first race you ever do in the game. The Horizon Festival Sprint. I break too late. I am a fool! Let's go! It sounds nice though. Let's do some races. I mean, one race, then we customize and race it again. Okay, let's go. Is this all wheel drive? That launched really well. Okay, let's get around eight. Okay, never mind. Someone took over eight position. Took that corner terribly. Ooh, there's a Zenvo in there. Gotta love this car. Ah, uh, damn it! No, I'm rewinding. That I hate that corner. Every time I take that turn terribly, I hit that and get stopped. Okay, fight for fourth. He blocked me by getting in my way. Get out of my way! Ooh, there's another Zero Uno there. I sometimes forget what car I'm driving. Move out of the way. Okay, we're going to Inventador. Right in front of us. Is that the convertible one? It is, I think. Yeah, it, yeah, it is. Okay, we are in first. I did not expect that to happen in the stock car. And we win! Ital Design! Okay, we did 125 in the ID Zero Uno. Let's do some customizing. Yeah! I have no idea how long I've been recording for, but I definitely feel like this video is going to be lengthy because I'm probably going to include the races in there. Okay, upgrade time. Okay, first we always go from the back then to the front. So let's have a look at the engine swaps. We got a 6.5 liter V12. I have no idea what car is that from, but probably it's a standard V12. And we got the racing V12. Nice. I'm probably not going to do an engine swap. Um, we are all wheel drive, but we can swap to our rear wheel drive. I nearly said our wheel drive. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, we can put a twin turbo and a centrifugal supercharger in there. But no positive displacement. Let's see. Forza Aero. And. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, so we got an Ital Design Sports Rear Wing, non-adjustable, okay. We got Forza Aero, that, no. And we got the Ital Design Remove Wing. I actually don't know how I'd prefer it. Maybe with the cool wing, yeah, we'll put that on. It looks cooler. Um, yep, race tail, I'll just put the lettering on because I like lettering. Boop. I'm probably gonna do top of S1 class. Okay, just let's max out all the handling related stuff. Brakes. Oh wait, not not brakes. I mean suspension. Uh, we'll just do stock. Roll cage, you know. Oh, this puts this. Oh, but I can have like 10 handling, but it puts us into S2. Oh, okay. I guess we'll put some performance parts on. I mean, not performance. Ooh. Huh. Yep, that's fine. Okay, top of S1. See, I, I, I don't want to be one of those guys who just maxes it out and doesn't have like a top of S2 class car, or just a uh, 
the, a car that is randomly just sitting in a class. I like putting in certain spots. Like some cars, I want an A class max or S one class max or S two class max. I don't. I like cars doing uh, doing doing it like that with cars. Let's do. S I pressed A one too many times right there. Okay, the gearing's fine. That's fine. Usually the differential. Hmm. Okay. Let's let's just do that and move that, and we're good. The car will handle perfectly. Let's design this. I'm not good with like decal editing or, or vinyl editing, but I can make some really nice paint jobs. Ooh, we got paint groups. Let's see. Okay, that's painting that. So the entire body, including the side of the wing. Um, paint group two. What do you handle? Okay, so it is the f front canard or whatever it's called, and that is it. Okay, wait, that was handling something else. No, wait, hold on, hold on. When I change the color, oh, I took off the decals as well. What the hell? You, you can't keep the decals. Shit, I went too far back. Okay, what's paint group three then? Okay, power of the front splitter area, the bumper I meant. So you can customize that. Is that changing color too? Side skirt? No. That's just pink. And nothing's happening on the rear. Okay. I want to paint it and keep that, but you can't. But then you got. Ooh. So this is what the other car was racing in. Okay, so if I'm going to paint it. I'm gonna grab that and go to special colors and I like the reflective color but sometimes this one as well semi gloss but I'm gonna go this one so we want the car in red right so let's put it in red first see what it looks like just full shiny highlight we'll put that in red okay I'm, I'm using my mouse just to help me out a bit okay so that looks nice now if we change the base to like an orange What's gonna happen there? Ooh, that's not bad What happens if I do the highlights instead? Boop Ooh Hmm that looks kind of nice. Let's try blue now. Okay, so let's put it in blue. I like this blue around here at 50%. It's probably my favorite looking blue. Little intense on someone, some people's eyes, but it's, I like it. Okay. Now, if we make the highlights a darker blue. So like here. Hmm. Ooh, purple. Purple looks nice. How about we do that with the base? Well, if you do it to the base, it's not as... Like, intense, but it looks nice. Actually, that's really cool. What happens if we do green instead? See a bit of green in there and... That's kind of cool. You can put yellow in there. Oh, I don't know, man. It's cool. How about red? Nah, that's weird. How about white? S straight up white. That's a pretty cool look too. Yeah, I'll go white. There we go. Um. Ah. Okay, let me let me quickly fix that. Mm. <laughs> okay. Sorry, mistake by me. Um, X for base color. But we'll make it white. I think it was white base and a blue highlight. 
Okay. Um, why? Let's press that. Let's go 50%. That means 0 0.5. Max it out. Oh shit, I forgot to save on the other one. Okay. Um, X. White. Save. And. Highlight. I didn't save on highlight as well. Why aren't you saving? There we go. Saving that. That looks nice. Now paint group 2 will do shiny carbon fiber. And paint group 3, same thing. Boom! Look at that! Let's race our creation now. I've probably been recording for 40 minutes now. <laughs> My bad. There's a lot of editing ahead of me, I guess. What's the time? Yeah. Okay, let's do one race. We'll probably do the same race. Oh, this car looks more intense in the back. Let's go. Solo hypercar. Look at that. You see a bit of white and a lot of blue. And it's really shiny. So it reflect reflection. Imagine Forza of Ray Tracing. Ooh, that'd be so cool. And hardware intensive. Ah! <laughs> oh! Okay. Let's see if we can get into first anyway. Get out of the way. Just crashing right through that. And I am in... Wait for it. Not in third. <laughs> Come on, get in the third. Get the out of my way. We'll shift down. More control over that corner. And let's catch up to the first. We got a Zenvo in front. This car is from Denmark. The Zenvo. Nice car. I think it's from Denmark. Yeah. I am in first after that fail at the start of the race. Oh, hit the wall. And we did one second slow because we crashed. But we won, came first. Well, this is the Zero Uno or Zero Uno. And it's a pretty cool car. I, I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye.